It's, it's creativity, you know, on every level. And that, that really appeals to me. That's something that I felt like I was, you know, I had kind of been losing over the, over the years. And um, as soon as I walked into this place, I just knew it, that this was, that I had, to, I had to do it. You know, I had to find a way to do it. And I was, you know, I had a good job in LA and, and working for a great restaurant with, with a great chef. And uh, it, this is a crazy move in a lot of ways, you know? But I think, you know, sometimes you hear about people saying you gotta follow your heart. And I think that this, you know, and I never, to be honest with you, I always kind of rolled my eyes when I, when I'd hear people say that, um, but it's true. I mean, you really, I think sometimes you just know. And, I, and when I came in here and, and saw the concept and met Clay, I just knew I had to do it, so. Uh, Oat House Collective is, is, it's unique. You know, it's a, uh, there's nothing within 50 miles in either direction that's similar to it, I think. And that is good people, um, providing a good place to have a good time. It's pretty simple, you know, but I think in my travels, it's pretty rare too, you know, it really, you, you know, I think of that, that it's a business, you know, and business is, is business and you ha in order to survive, you have to make money. Um, but, you, you know, you, uh, that doesn't mean it, do it can't be cool, you know what I mean? <laughs> And fun. so, yeah, and fun, exactly. And, that, and that's really, you know, there are times when it's less than fun here, but um, that's because we're, we're pushing ourselves too. You know, we're really, we wanna, be, we, we wanna be great on every level. And so there's a kind of, there's a mix of, of fun and creativity, but there's also a seriousness about making, making the Boathouse Collective a great place.